Capricorn, what's up? I'ma just um give y'all pretty much a general spread. Um, I'ma just pull some cards, read them out, and deliver a message to y'all, okay? I definitely hope it resonates, and I definitely hope the messages are useful for y'all. <laughs> I don't know why that was so aggressive, but um yeah, with that being said, I'ma literally shuffle the deck. I'll give it two more times for y'all, and we're just going to get right into it, all right? Enjoy. So for Capricorn, try to get some messages for her. Capricorn is watching. You have the moon coming out. It did want to come out in reverse, but I'm not going to take reversals in the zodiac reads. Yeah, and you have the eight of cups coming out as well, Capricorn. Messages for Capricorn, please. Messages for Capricorn. <clears throat> Messages for Capricorn, please. You have the ace of cups coming out as well. The temperance card. You have the death. Message for Capricorn. You have the five of pentacles coming out. A lot, of, a lot of them are coming out in reverse. Um, of course, I'm not going to take them with the Hermit. And then you also have the Page of Swords. But I feel like something isn't done with, with the, all of the reversals. With the Kia Cups in reverse at the bottom. Um, heavy water sign energy, though. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Especially with the King of Cups at the bottom. But also with the Moon and the Death. Um, that's all three water elements. Um, and with the page of sword, so you got Sagittarius again. I'm sorry, energy also Capric um Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Um, you also have Taurus, and you do also have Virgo. <clears throat> Excuse me. It does seem like somebody's eyeing you. You could have walked away from a situation and completely. I feel like it's transformed. I feel like somebody is viewing you as somebody completely different. Um, somebody with the moon is also could be viewing you as somebody that they almost don't even know. Um, with the Hermit and the Page of Swords, it does feel like, even with the Eight of Cups and the Five of Pentacles, it's like you left one situation and it's almost like you, you've you learned you've learned so much more about yourself or that's how you're like coming across, especially like with the Tempers, he's almost look like an angel in a sense. I feel like, at least for right now, you're really in this like, um, almost like an expansion type of um, time period, almost like for yourself. Um, it's almost like you, you could be like learning more, studying more. Um, you could be getting some sort of like, type, sort of like type of craft as well. It's almost like you could even be walking away from a job. I don't, it's like you're going to, you're going to walk, you're going to step right into something that you really enjoy doing or love doing. Like you're really going to really put your heart and I want to say your mind, body, and soul into something, but you're le after you leave something behind, after you change something else with the death. Can I get messages for Capricorn? Literally, with the Nine of Wands and the High Priestess coming out, your intuition is on <laughs> like on point right now as well. It's on fire with the Nine of Wands. What's the Nine of Wands and the High Priestess? You could definitely um, be dealing with some sort of like Pisces energy. You don't have to literally with the your intuition is on point right now. I honestly want to say if anybody is trying to like I want to say beguile you. Hopefully I said that word correctly. Um, or try to get, like get one over on you. Um, trusting your intuition, staying strong, staying firm in your um intuition. Like your first gut reaction, at first like um natural like instinct. Trust it, believe in it, because I feel like you you're on point. Like you're on point. Literally with the three of cups coming out. <clears throat> messages for capricorn yeah and the ten of the ten of swords this could even be yeah with the nine of cups it is at the bottom in reverse with the three of um cups and the ten of swords i do feel like there could have been a situation where your intuition could have been telling you to leave some sort of friend group um or that people could have honestly been um almost like even bad mouthing you in a sense it's something where you need to trust your intuition especially about um friends a group of friends could be two to three people because with the ten of swords there could be a painful literally it's how it's something about you trusting your int your intuition is about trying to tell you something about 
a specific person or a group of individuals. Um, I feel like I'm not getting that you're not listening, but there is there there it's something about really paying close attention to what your intuition is trying to tell you because I feel like it's trying to get you out of the way of some sort of like upheaval, some sort of disaster. Um, I feel like um, it's also trying to get you almost like out of the way so your feelings kind of don't get hurt. There's something about your feelings. It's like your intuition is trying to get you out the way before your feelings get hurt. Yeah, with the Page of Wands coming out and the Devil card falling out as well. Like somebody could be getting ready to come towards you with like some childish, like some sort of childish message. I f it's, it's, it's given the energy that I feel like somebody's going to really try to test you or your patience, especially with the Temperance card coming out. It's like somebody's going to try to deliberately get under your skin. And it's almost like the, your intuition could have been telling you to move away from this person already. Literally, the three of wands. And it's like you could have been procrastinating on doing this. You could have been waiting to do this as well. But somebody does want to send you some sort of like message, especially with the devil. That is your energy, Capricorn. What's this three of wands? Can I get a message for Capricorn with the hangman? One more. With the queen of swords. This could be a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, or a Pisces in specific. Yeah, with the, this person. Why? I don't know. Capricorn, you have somebody in your energy who um, I want to say is a little envious of this transformation. You have somebody who is a little envious or not even necessarily envious. They're just really watching you, watching your progression, I want to say. So much so that I feel like it's like they're, they're so like somebody's really distracted by you, I feel like. That they're not paying attention to their own like world. The things that they kind of have to like take care of. It's like they're waiting. Mm -hmm. Somebody's too focused on you. I feel like Capricorn. Again, could be a um, Libra Aquarius or a Gemini. This person again is in like a hanging. This person is like stuck on you. They're stuck literally with the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, and the four. This is somebody who holds on to you. Somebody who is not trying to release you as well. I feel like this is somebody I feel like this could be a baby's mother. But if not, I feel like this is just somebody who is not literally with this, this person is not trying to let go of you. This could even be somebody who's viewing you in a queen of swords energy waiting for you to return back to them. Could even be a Leo. Yeah, with the three of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Messages for Capricorn, please. The Wheel of Fortune coming out, the Seven of Wands, and the Nine of Swords. Yo, yeah, somebody's waiting for you to, like, return back to them. It's almost like somebody's in the exact same place you left them. At. Like, it's like somebody's almost like it's not hard to find. Somebody's waiting for you to reach out, I feel like. Like, it's like somebody's afraid to move on. Like, somebody doesn't want to move on from another person, I feel like. Especially with this Nine of Swords. The Will of Fortune, the Seven of Wands, and the Nine of Swords. Literally with the sun. Could definitely be a... Somebody views you as like... You make somebody happy with the lovers at the bottom. You make somebody extremely happy. I feel... I don't... I, yeah. But it's like somebody... Somebody feels like they have no idea who you are, Capricorn. Capricorn. Somebody feels like you took a leap of faith to, away from them with this fool. Like somebody feels like you are smarter than you were before like you you hit some sort of upgrade like somebody was not expecting some sort of change out of you with the two of cups coming out the eight of pentacles and the four of pentacles yeah with the knight of pentacles i feel like this person definitely is moving slow if they didn't in the pit like this is somebody who wants to approach you and i feel like if this isn't somebody because this is somebody that wants to reconcile with the three of cups I feel like this person is working on themselves with the Two of Cups, the Eight of Pentacles, and the Four of Pentacles. I feel like they are working on things that they know they have to change in order to kind of bring something into, like, fruition with the Two of Cups, the Eight of Pentacles, and the Four of Pentacles. It's almost like this person's like, look, I really got to work on things, possibly inner, even, like, inner things with the Four of Pentacles. It's like this person knows they just have to change just not only the exterior, but the... um. 
the exterior as well again to even feel like they could bring a situation a situation between you and them into fruition like this person is just like yo i have to change this i have to make sure i got this under control i have to i don't know don't you just for capricorn please with the y'all with the lovers and the six of wands this definitely could be a leo this could even be a gemini capricorn it definitely does seem like you have somebody in your your energy who is definitely viewing you as somebody who i honestly want to say so strongly that i feel like this is somebody who feels like they are supposed to be with you um or vice versa you are supposed to be with them take it however it resonates um <laughs> like they want a family structure um i almost want to say this person even could want like an apartment with you um they see success with the six of wands with like this is definitely a lovery feels like for you though capricorn but overall especially from the beginning because the energy was very pure was very genuine i felt like especially in the beginning somebody feels like you you've under you you have went under some sort of change um somebody feels like you look at the the world not even them somebody feels like you look at the world completely differently i don't this definitely gives an energy where it's like somebody this person this this energy knows you or knows like they, they they've been around you to the point where they can see a change in you almost they feel like you're a lot more secure with yourself as well like this is somebody who honestly is very proud um, literally with the queen of wands. Definitely could be a fire sign on your hands. A Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Um, wow, with the queen of cups at the bottom. Or this, that, this person views. <laughs> wow, this is good, Capricorn. This is good. This is good. With the justice card coming out. Yeah, with the empress now at the bottom. Somebody views you in a very, very high light, a very, very um, high regard. Um, with the Justice card, I'm definitely getting, somebody views you as like fair. It's like somebody knows they can't get anything out of you without giving back to you. Uh, hold on. <laughs> wow. Is Somebody just views you as very fair. Um, I'm gonna try to try to all the way back over again. I feel like I'm getting too excited and I feel like I can't speak right. Um, with the justice card, it feels like somebody views you again as somebody who is very fair. Um, they know they won't get much out of you or the situation with you without properly pouring back into you as well. Um, and with the Queen of Wands, I'm not going to lie, it's not necessarily the Ace of Wands, but for the Queen of Wands and the Justice, I feel like that's even like sexually. Um, somebody f views you as very... Um, I want to say endearing, um, very sexual. Like, um, you, they view you as just the two of y'all as compatible in every way, almost, um, especially intellectually and physically. Um, somebody feels like it will be like a never ending, like joyful time with you. Wow, Capricorn. Messages for Capricorn, please. Just for Capricorn, literally with the Knight of Swords, somebody wants to take action towards you with the magician at the bottom. They do. All right, let's get some closing out cards. Last few messages for Capricorn. Can I get some last few messages for Capricorn with the Seven of Cups coming out? Last few messages for Capricorn. Last few messages for Capricorn. <clears throat> and you have the Hierophant. Let's get one more. For the, so what's the Seven of Cups and the higher thing? Let's do that. What's the Seven, the Three of Pentacles? <laughs> I feel like, wow, with the King of Swords. I feel like somebody is like praying for you. I feel like somebody um could be a Taurus. Um, I almost want to say somebody's trying to procreate with you. you know? Somebody is really trying to like, compliment like compliment you like somebody's really trying to figure out a way almost like a game plan because with the seven of cups the higher and the three of pentacles i'm not gonna lie was a little alarming at first but because i was nervous that it was going to talk about something about a third party but i'm not getting the energy i'm gonna be completely honest this is somebody who one somebody could be trying to figure out their religion as well i feel like somebody is trying to figure out if you are religious um um 
Yo, I feel like somebody's really like praying to like God. There's something about praying to God with the seven of cups, the higher fin, the three of like there somebody's try somebody sees you procreating with like God, higher source. Like somebody feels like you have so many different avenues with the seven of cups. It's like, oh my God, it's like somebody feels like you're like a triple threat, but you're more than that with the seven of like somebody feels like you are connected to God. Like you are like you work closely with, with God. I feel like that just took a turn, didn't it? <laughs> um, last few cards. Let's close this out. For Capricorn, can I get a message for Capricorn, please? With the Page of Cups. I feel like just... Yeah, and the star. I feel like this definitely could be an Aquarius. Doesn't have to be. Could even be a Taurus. Um, but even even if somebody did, let's throw it out there. Put, um, put you in a third party or just treated you as more like an option. I feel like... Somebody has seen the error of their ways. Um, this is if this is a past person, take with however you however it resonates. Um, but I do Capricorn feel like somebody has seen you more so as like a is God like. Um, I would be very surprised if people didn't just assume you were like Christian or so. Like I don't know. Um, yeah, Capricorn, this is a good read. Though I can't really put it even into words. It was just a very positive read. The energy is very positive. I I can just say that. Um, didn't really drain me at all. It was very, very uplifting in a way. But um, yeah, Capricorn, that was y'all read. And I really do hope it resonates. And I do hope you guys enjoyed and the messages were useful for y'all. And until next time, bye.